welcome back to yet another video. Today I'm going to be showing you five, five plus apps for your computer, extensions, apps, and sites that are very, very helpful and I thought were cool for the upcoming school year. And like all students can use these, whether you're in elementary school, middle school, high school, these will totally help you out. And um, yeah, let's just get right into the video then. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, let's go besties. Basically, I've researched a lot into this and stuff the most you can for finding applications and apps for your computer. And I found quite a few that I thought would be helpful for the upcoming school year and would be, you know, just nice to have on your computer in case you actually want something or looking for something that might be helpful. I have my handy dandy list on my phone right here and I keep looking at myself. But yes, okay, so let's begin that because this is, this is going to be awesome. Before we do get into the video, I just want to say that all of these Chrome extensions, apps, and computer thingamajigs will be linked in the description to make it easier for you to find them so you don't have to, you know, do all that hard work. I got you, bestie. Don't worry, I got you. So the first one I'm going to be showing you today is a site called Slides Go, and this is basically a site where there are a bunch of slide templates that you can use for free, and they look absolutely amazing. The, and these work for Google Slides, and a lot of them already have presets and items that are already on them. They have a lot of aesthetic cute ones that you can use as well. And overall, it is just a really fun site to look through different slide presentations, pick ones out that you like, and make learning a whole lot more fun. Here you can also search from ones that you recently looked at, popular ones, education ones, business ones, marketing, medical, multi-purpose, or infographic. They also have a thing where you can sign into your own account and view slides that you looked at previously and they have a lot of different colors and ideas so instead of making your own slides you could just do this and quickly get graphs and cute icons that you can use for slides for your school use and overall it is just very fun and cute to see. Another cool feature of this site is that once you find a slide that you want to work off of you can either bring it into PowerPoint presentation or a Google slide you can favorite it and keep it for later and you could just get a lot ones of your slideshows planned out ahead of time and you can copy and paste super cute icons to use throughout your slide process and it's just very nice to have on the go. Next app and extension for your computer is absolutely amazing. This is called Taskcade and you can organize to-do lists on your computer, check mark things off that you have already completed, and a bunch of things like that. All you have to do to download it is go and search Taskcade in the Chrome Web Store and it should be Team Tasks, Notes, and Video Chat. And you could just go ahead and add it to your Chrome. And once you have added the extension to your Chrome, you can personalize your experience, of course, and do all of that. You can also sign up or continue as a guest. And making an account is completely free with this. From Taskcade, you can name lists like things to do or homework. You can enter tasks that you need to do throughout the day, such as do homework. And you can add a bunch of blocks and as many as you want. You have so many different things that you can do to personalize it, such as making a checklist with little hearts or uh, order them or uh, add a singular bullet and things like that. So there is a lot that you can do here and just have fun with it. You can also add due dates and tags so you remember to do things. You can also organize it with boards and you can also go back out and have more projects and create new projects so you keep everything as organized as you can be working online check mark things off and boom you're good to go so this is definitely one that i recommend in my opinion and is actually really fun to work with it just takes a little bit of figuring out it'll also keep you a roadmap and the things that you have completed so you actually feel like you're getting stuff done This next one can also be found on the Google Chrome store and it is called One Tab. So all you wanna do is search it up, and then you can go ahead and add it to your Chrome. Here we go, add the extension, besties. And once you have added the extension, you can find it in this little corner with extensions. And from here, you have the ability 
to organize all of your tabs. In case you have a ton of tabs open, you can go ahead and delete them from here really easily and organize them super easily. So you can, instead of searching through all your tabs and switching without finding what you're looking for, you can go to one tab and it, it will just bring you to where you wanna go. Open up different tabs that you have on different areas. You can delete them all, restore them all, and other things as well, which is just super helpful to use in case you wanna organize your tabs. When you are having a ton of them open for back to school and you're working on something or a research project that might need a little bit of organizing and one tab will always show up on the left. It is super easy to take off the extension if you don't like it as well. So it's just super easy to have on the left while you are studying, working and researching to keep track of all your tabs and what you have open. This next one can also be found on the Chrome store as per usual. And all you wanna look up is forest. Now, once you search up forest, you can quickly add it to Chrome, and this is an awesome feature of this app. Basically, you can stay focused in a pleasant way in case you need to watch a video or you want to spend like 30 minutes working. You, Whenever you wanna focus on your work, you plant a tree and you start a timer that grows the tree to full once you have finished working on what you wanna do. And if you take away a bit of time or don't pause it, your tree will actually die. So it is good at keeping you on task and being awesome. So let's add it to Chrome. Once you've added it to Chrome, it's super easy to play with and all you have to do is pick the amount of time you want to study for or stay on the computer for or anything like that and then click it and your tree will be planted and you will get to harvest it once you finally finish what you are working on and it's just super duper cute. You can also set a personal goal and stuff and do a bunch of things with this and have it up in the corner so you can check back whenever you want and stay on task by planting a tree and watching it grow once the timer is over. This next one is also super duper helpful if you have a hard time with big words or anything like that. If you're reading through an article and you don't understand something, all you have to do is download the Google Dictionary extension. Of course, I will have all of these extensions linked to make it way easier for you guys to find. But once you add this to Chrome, it will be super easy to use. All you have to do to use the dictionary extension is highlight a word you don't understand and then bring up the Google dictionary and it will define it for you super quickly, especially if you're using online school or need something where you're using a computer a bunch and you're researching a bunch of hard words or big words that you don't necessarily understand. Google dictionary is super helpful and whenever you don't know a word, just highlight it, click the dictionary and it will quickly bring up, like very quickly whenever you click the dictionary, will define the word that you don't understand and help you stay on task even more. This next one is also super helpful. It is called Dual Less, and once you download it, it will be super easy to use as most of these are. And basically what this extension does for you is it splits the screen of Google Chrome however you want. So there are a bunch of different options for this, but you can quickly press it and it will do all of the work for you, especially if you wanna watch a video or do something while you are using it. It is super helpful to use. You can have a two times one, any basic setting that you want. You can have a single tab, an empty tab, anything you want, right align, left align, and it's just fun to play with overall for back to school. Bye everyone, thank you so much for watching. I hope these sites helped you. Let me know if you want a part two or any more that I come across. I can make a video on those as well. And I might also make an iPad apps one and stuff like that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.